Ever since Ulrich Leyland took over the captain of the guard post, this city's gone downhill. Roads go ever, ever on To the lands beyond the sea If you never say hello Greetings and welcome to this adventure of Felon Frisky, episode 17. I traveled here to Shaden Hall to uh, make some more money off the Dark Brotherhood, um, deliver the information to the speaker stuff that you hear once a week from the Night Mother. In the process, I stumbled across a town rumor, a quest called Corruption and Conscience. And I figured, yeah, let's mess with that one. Someone to meet down there, we should go see him, and we'll see what this quest is. I believe this is the quest that involves the guy who's got the guard in front of his door here. Yeah, see? I'm sorry. No one except for Chaden Hall City Guard are allowed inside this home. Due to outstanding fines owed to the city, Aldous Authorant's property has been seized and is now sealed until further notice. That's one hell of a Dead. fine. How you expect him to pay the city back if um, you can't let him get to his stuff to sell off, you know, his property for his debt? Oh. This house? I guess what I'm looking for is in here. We'll see if they're ready for house guests. Hello, anyone in here? Stairs, maybe? Yeah, there's somebody. Excuse me, ma'am. You seem far too nice to be one of Ulrich's men. What can Ulrich? I do for you? Like Ulrich Stormcloak? Oh, Ulfric, sorry. Ulfric Stormcloak. Um, the fines. Oh, please, don't even get me started. That madman won't be satisfied until everyone in town is dead broke. Or in jail. Hi, Prince John. What in oblivion is Ulrich doing with all that money anyway? I'm sure he's lining his pockets with the gold of the good citizens of Chadenhall. Take my good friend Aldous Othran, for example. In the last month, he's been fined six times. Six! All for being drunk and disorderly. Um... Have you ever gone past a guard barracks? When are they not drunk and disorderly? What kind of a stupid fine is that? Well, Aldous couldn't pay the last two fines, so they seized his home and threw him into the street until he could pay it. Bastards! Well, um, I don't know about you, but if I ever decided to go out and get drunk and disorderly, they'd throw my ass in jail, too. I don't even think they'd give me a fine. Especially if I have to get behind the wheel of a car. What about the Count? The Count? He could care less about our plight. As long as the roast suckling pig is delivered to his feast table, he's as happy as can be. Hmm, should have robbed him. Is there anyone who cares? Well, her, obviously. Kind of a dumb question, but... Well, there's one man who seems to care. Garrus Dorelian, the second in command of the guard. I hear he isn't happy with Ulrich. I don't know what you can do for us in this situation. I mean, Ulrich is a captain after all. Perhaps you could speak to Garrus. You can find him roaming the county hall of the castle most of the time. Oh, very well. I'll go speak to him, then. Although, you know, you are in a city with the Dark Brotherhood. You could put a request in to, say, see a certain captain of the guard killed off. I mean, we did kill uh, Philida a while back. Garrus may be our only hope. Well... I'll go have a talk with the chap, and we'll see what um, he's willing to do with anything. In the castle, just stand clear. You know, guard standing in front of doors really makes me want to pick the locks, doesn't it? Hey, I never said I was good at picking locks ever. I remember saying I was quite bad at it.
What do you want? I'm just going up the castle, sir. I don't know what the problem is. It's not like I'm a Dark Brotherhood uh, listener on my way to murder your count. You should thank me. I'm even taking the time to go over here. Good grief. Ah! Alright. Find the man I'm looking for. Let's hope he's somewhere I can get to him easily. Yes. Oh, that one's too hard to find him. He's right there. Sir. What do you want? Um, I want to give you a little what? cash bribe. Oh, yeah, definitely. Here you go. That will get you. You can trust me. Um, uh, let's talk about your, uh, superior officer. It appears you've spoken to Lavana. I know she sounds a bit like a raving madwoman, but she isn't far from the truth. Ulrich is definitely up to something. Every day. We take in exorbitant fines from the people. Where most of the money goes, <laughs> I have a good idea. Oh, Where? keeps his quarters locked. But I've glimpsed inside. The things he has in there could never be purchased on a captain's salary. At first, I thought maybe he was from wealthy stock. But many of the goods have been delivered recently. I'd love to bring him to task in front of Count Indaris. But I dare not without a solid witness that will speak against him. Oh, come on. He, maybe a relative of his died and so, or something. You know, got a big inheritance. A wealthy uncle or something. All right. What about Honestly, her? She's never done anything to be fined or get in trouble. Yet. The person I'd love to bring in as a witness is Aldos Arthurin. That is, if we could sober him up for five minutes. Uh -oh. I haven't approached him myself, as Ulrich has eyes everywhere. However, he doesn't know you well enough yet to suspect anything. If you want to help, you need to get Aldos to agree to become a witness. Nothing else can be done. Sobering a drunk up. Um, that, That's like the easiest task, after all. Is there enough black coffee or something in this game to... No, um... Maybe wake up juice. I hear that might work wonders. Um, what about Aldos? Aldos is living on the street now that his house has been seized. I begged Ulrich to give him more time, but he wouldn't. He won't be hard to find. Just follow the smell of stale mead. Last I checked, drunks are not exactly the best uh, source for information, but all right. Must locate Aldos. He's a danger to himself. And others have danger to himself, to say the least. He's probably hitting the bottle still. So we gone from one crazy story to an episode probably containing a drunk. <laughs> Yay! We are not getting anywhere in the class here, are we? Gotta find the bum then. Loading area, yeah, go ahead. Hmm. Campfire over there. Let me guess who that is. With the bottle. This guy looks really reliable, doesn't he? Who are you? He sounds really reliable too, doesn't they? Um, the Sawfrick fellow. Ha! That stupid swit! Throw me out of my home, will he? I'll show him a thing or two about messing with an Othran. All I did was fall down, sure. Maybe even vomited on the floor of the tavern. Charge me six times, Ulrich! Charge me, you fetcher! Well, I'm not standing for this anymore. You come with me and I'll show you what the Othrens can do when their backs are to the wall. Quite literally in his case. Wait, wait a minute! I take it I'm actually supposed to literally follow you step by step, huh? I get the feeling this is going to end really badly. This is my house. Hello. Get out of the way. Move, I say. Sir, 
This property has been seized by his lordship, the Count of Chadenhall. Leave immediately. I said move, or by my ancestors, I'll put you on the ground with a split lip. Sir, I must warn you that threatening a city guardsman is an offense punishable by a fine of no less than 50 gold. That's it. Or be jailed. You swit. How and hitting him is more expensive than that. Be damned. He can take his fine and stuff it up his backside. You've been warned. You're now under arrest. Please, come with me. I'll go nowhere with you, fetcher. Nowhere. Oh, don't do that. Oh, heavens. <laughs> well, that's the drunk for you. The drunk just got slain by a Shaden Hall guard. He had led me to his old house where he exchanged heated words with the guard during this argument. Aldo's pulled a knife and the guard put him down. Yeah, that's not good. However, I will loot his corpse since I'm here. Probably has nothing. Oh, 11 gold. Pewter mug. Iron dagger. Yeah, we'll take it. Well, that's going to be hard to explain. Well, on the plus side, he doesn't have to worry about paying fines anymore. Is something amiss? Oh, yes. <laughs> you know your buddy out there? Guess what? Oh, no. They killed him. I can't believe this. Ever since his wife passed at the hands of the bandits, his life has been miserable. I'd grown to become fond of him. I wanted to take him into my house. Why didn't but I was you? And now look what's become of him. A corpse. There are no more options left. Ulrich must be dealt with, and actions speak louder than words. You must do something for me. Okay, what? Go tell Ulrich that I have some information that incriminates him. Tell him to come alone, or he won't get it. Oh, good grief. Then lead him here, and I'll do the rest. Why did she just let the Dark Brotherhood kill him? I promise you. Alright, what to do? Do I go do it, or do I talk to the other guard and tell him that she's thinking about murder? Stand clear. Shut up. Um, made me no offer of reward. Yeah, we're gonna tell the other guard. I, I don't want her to end up a corpse like, um, drunk back there. <laughs> Do you want to hear something funny? I feel Ulrich's eyes upon me as we speak. Forget he that. Put an end to the Aldos will be mourned. I won't sit by and watch the innocent being driven to the brink like that. Something must be done, but without bloodshed. Too late. Um, how about this? Levana has always been quick-tempered. You must reconsider her plan. It can only lead to prison for her and for you. Only if I'm caught. I swear that Ulrich will pay for this. We must handle this carefully and prove to the Count that he needs to be arrested. Ulrich has been watching me, so I haven't been able to enact a plan I devised to bring him down. What is it? Plans today, now that you're here. Okay, what? The well? The evidence we need to incriminate Ulrich must lie within his quarters. You must sneak in there and retrieve it without being seen. Um, our stuff. If you're caught, there isn't anything I can do to help you. Just be careful. If I'm caught, I'm going to jail. Oh, good, he gave me the key. At least not to pick the lock. Indeed a tragedy. All right, well, we'll go sneak in there, then. Just as soon as we figure out where it's at. Outside the castle? Alright, well, apparently his quarters are around here somewhere. Let's find out where his quarters are and sneak in there. I should be able to walk into the guard barracks okay. I want to sneak around now, though. Yep. 
Yeah, we're not trespassing. That's good. Excuse me, sir. Sir? What is it, sir? Um, I guess you're not going to give me directions if I asked. Just leave. Oh, don't worry about me. I've got a key. Oh. Of course, he's not going to bunk with the standard guards, is he? So as soon as he turns around, this is the door I can take. All right. Something in here should be incriminating. But what? I usually find it easier just to plant evidence. Than... Ooh, suspicious letter. Let's read that. I discovered a letter. Yay. Uh... Pause if you want to read it. Got Shaden Hall, a bed. Oh boy. And a hard lock. You know what would be a cool skill? <laughs> the ability to open all these instantly. Eight gold. Eh, brass ring. Sure. All right, we'll just exit. So all I gotta do is return this suspicious letter to, uh... You know, I don't even remember his name now. Little bad habit I'm into. Just don't remember characters' names. Especially fantasy characters. Still where I left you, eh? How would you like to be new captain of the guards? Back. Good. Did you find the evidence? Uh, yeah. You've done it. This letter will spell his undoing when I present it to Count Indaris. Splendid work. Splendid work indeed. I must hasten to the Count and deliver this immediately. He's Please sitting ne near you. Back at the Chaden Hall Bridge Inn in about two hours. I must speak to the Count. Oh, boy. Shh. Sure! I'll see you there. Alright, so... It's kind of actually funny how he did this loop-around run just to go to see the Count, who was literally, like, four feet away from him. Sometimes this game does not make much sense. in two hours. Okay, so one, two, we'll just wait. Uh, let's see what he has to say. For you. After speaking to the Count and in light of the evidence you recovered, yes. Ulrich has been removed from his post and arrested. Many guards are coming forward with more evidence of his greed, so it's safe to say he'll be spending quite a bit of time in the city dungeons. Oh, good. I should go mock him. I've been promoted to the post of Captain of the Guard and hope to return respect to the peacekeepers of this town. The Count and I thank you for helping bring Ulrich's hold on Chaden Hall to an end and for doing so without unnecessary bloodshed. As a token of our gratitude, as you did this, at the risk of false imprisonment, or perhaps your life. We reward you this bounty of gold. Oh? How much? On behalf of the people of Chaden Hall, I thank you. Is it Chaden Hall or Shaden Hall? 250 gold. Well, that's kind of anticlimactic. Ulrich will be spending years in the city dungeons. Great! I'm gonna go bug him. Until we meet again. <laughs> That'd be fun. City dungeons, eh? Well... Let's put a little extra into this, then. There's no problem. Oh, I'd like to visit a prisoner. I suppose I have to. Keep your hand to yourself in there. I'll be right next to you. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm just here to gloat. Thank you! I haven't got all day. Boy, look, a jailboid! You better hope I never get out of here. <laughs> Where are 
<laughs> you gotta go. Uh. <laughs> may not accept gifts. You're th I haven't even met you yet. You're just threatening me. <laughs> Prisoners. Well, that was somewhat entertaining. I'm surprised he even knew that I'm the one that put him in there. That was literally the first time I saw him. He's threatening me from behind bars. Well, I'm going to end this episode here. I realize that makes this episode rather short in comparison. But um, we'll probably pick up on the main quest and continue that next week. Yes, we'll probably go see Martin Septim or Joffrey about the Amulet of Kings next week and continue the main quest. So until then, I don't have time for I've been Cloak, and thank you for watching this relatively short episode of Adventures of Fallen Frisky. Have a good day. Well, now I just have to get ready to do the larger quests. Thank <laughs> you.